selected members from 20 chapters underwent the training, and the DR in turn required to conduct similar programs in their respective chapters within three months. Training manuals dealing with internet tools such as blogs, wikis, and social networks have been prepared and made available online for all of us. Another major activity was planned at the request of the collector of Ramanathapuram in Tamil Nadu. Elta, in collaboration with Tasim Abdul Kader College for Women, Kilakari organized two-day training programs spreading over 10 days for about 1,200 government school teachers divided into 10 batches. This was greatly appreciated by the participating teachers as well as the school education administrators of the district. And in an attempt to promote action research among teachers at all levels, as part of the continuous professional development, our association has launched a new scheme of financial assistance to our members to undertake action research projects. We have received a few proposals and the winners of the grant will be announced shortly. WMS, under IATOFL's wider membership scheme, we have got 100 entire members enrolled and they get free copies of newsletter Voices. WMS helps the international ELT community reach out to teachers to parts of the world who, add, who need additional financial support. And now we are taking another step of affiliating ourselves with the TESOL, yet another major global ELT organization, Ch our chapters. As the executive has decided to drop the inactive chapters, about 10 chapters have been deleted so far, and two new chapters have been added to us, ten, one at Visakhapatnam, Andhra Pradesh, and the other at Vildanagar in Tamil Nadu. We have 52 active chapters now. Relo in its attempt to increase the active members has sponsored 10 delegates to attend the conference here. And similar to last year, this year also one chapter